Hey, what's up, guys? Now, some big news came out today. Apple made the iPad official, and it will have a render display, LTE, in the A5X CPU or processor, and it will be available March 16th. Now, the render display will be the screen will still be 9.7 inch screen, but it will have over 3.1 million pixels and will be in the range in a 2048 by 1536 arrangement. So that account to 264 PPI, which would make this display pretty amazing. So the A5X processor will also have a quad core graphic chip. So the iPad is not going to be quad core, it's still going to be dual core, but it will have a quad core chip. So they said it's going to be tw twice as fast as the iPad 2. You really have to test that out to yourself to see if it's any faster. It will also have a 5 megapixel cam camera capable of 1080p video. Now, I find this very interesting because they didn't bump it up all the way to 8 megapixel, but it's still better than the iPod Touch, but it's still not as good as the iPhone 4S. But they did bump it up a little, as people did want to see on it. And it will have a dictation key on the keyboard now, so it won't exactly have Siri, but it has something very similar to Siri. And this and this iPad 3 will be capable of Wi-Fi hotspot. Now, the very cool thing about this iPad 3 is that it will have LTE and it said it will be able of 21 megabytes of speed which you probably won't get in the US but you will get somewhere close to that because 21 megabytes of speed you really have to get down to a really good area. Now Apple is claiming that it will have 10 hours of battery life and 9 hours of battery life on LTE. You really have to test that out yourself to see. The iPad 2 did have pretty much battery, pretty good battery life. That was the reason it didn't up it up all the way to a quad core processor because that do drain your battery a lot. And it will be available March 16, starting at 4.99. So no really price change. And Apple did cut down the iPad 2 price to 3.99. So if you don't really want the iPad 3 to run like the upgrade, you can just get the iPad 2. It's pretty much the same model, just upgraded. In size so yeah guys that's pretty much it for this video this the iPad 3 is now official please like this video and leave a comment below about what you think about this new iPad 3 and yeah that's it guys subscribe if you're not already and yeah hope to see you next one alright guys bye